devastating wildfire that is spreading across California. This is a live look at it right now. Take a look here. It is just tearing through Ventura County. It exploded from 50 acres to more than 31,000, and it did that in, in just hours. That is fast moving, and overnight, this fast moving fi uh, fire has forced thousands of people to face mandatory evacuations. More than 100 buildings are completely destroyed. We're going to go to ABC's Marcus Moore. He's on the ground in Ventura this morning with more. Good morning, Marcus. Michael, it is a terrible scene here. You see the smoke billowing into the air in Ventura, and look at this. This is an apartment building that is destroyed. It burned overnight, and right now fire crews are still putting water on it to try to knock down any hot spots as the fight to stop the Thomas fire from spreading is just getting underway. This morning, flames light up the sky in Southern California's Ventura County. A massive wildfire roaring through these foothills, overnight recording wind gusts up to 68 miles per hour. This is the biggest problem, the wind shifts. Blasting fiery embers down the street, electrical lines going up in flames, and this home decimated. All as firefighters try to stop the spread. Literally like 15 feet away from us right now. This group panicked oh, as the flames start there. closing in. We need to get out of here as soon as possible. That fire is right there. Yeah. Mandatory evacuation orders in effect as thousands race to escape the flames. The entire hillside all throughout Ventura is on fire. All the street lights are out. There's ashes everywhere. People were driving really fast. No one really knew what to do. My son is a firefighter, and um, I'm not going to wait around for somebody to have to come rescue me, so I'm out of here. These flames overnight continuing to spread to homes here in Ventura County. It is a heartbreaking thing to see. You've lived here 19 years. Mm -hmm. so this is home. Oh. But I don't know how much longer. <laughs> and to have to leave this your is home. too frightening for me. This fire captain stunned by the fire's speed. Seven, eight, Rapid fire movement. Um, this fire's moved as fast as any fire I've ever seen. Sheriff's office, anybody home? Police going door to door. Emotions high in this neighborhood as homeowners scramble to gather whatever they can before leaving. I was in disbelief and shock. That's all. That's all. You never expected somebody to come over the hills as it did. Shelters filling up, massive power outages all the way north to Santa Barbara. Nearly 200,000 people in the dark. The sun rising here this morning is revealing the scale of the devastation here. All of these fire crews continue to work as they put the water here to knock down those hot spots over concerns that perhaps the fire could flare back up again. And I want to show you what it looks like on this street here. You see that vehicle that's burned out off in the distance there. That is an evidence of the wind picking up the ambers and landing on vehicles like that and setting them on fire. And it was just an incredible scene overnight watching this fire as it moved through this part of Ventura. And you see in the distance there, those palm trees still standing as that black smoke lifts into the air. It is, gives you a, just a sense of how much devastation there is, even on the hilltops there. There are so many homes that this morning are gone all because of this fire that continues to burn out of control in some part of Ventura. And this could be a critical turning point for fire crews as they try to knock down this fire because they may be, for the very first time, they may be able to use helicopters to fight it from the air. They weren't able to do that, to do that overnight because of the darkness. And also, Ginger, the Santa Ana winds that you've been telling us about that have been fanning the flames here in Southern California. That's exactly right. Thank you so much, Marcus. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.